Hey everyone, welcome to this week's episode of CAF Tactical, Civilian as Fuck. This episode I'm going to show you guys my wife's plate carrier. Now, she wanted a multicam plate carrier because she thinks the camo pattern is cool, just like I do. And she wanted something that was a little bit less bulky, uh, not so robust, more like a minimalistic style, slick kind of plate carrier. Um, she doesn't wear hard plates, she just wears level 3 soft armor inside, so that way it can conform to her body better. She didn't really like the weight of the rifle rated plate carriers and didn't feel it was necessary, so she went with the soft armor. So what we did was I shopped around and I found this Black Hawk slick plate carrier for $20 on eBay. I was like, for 20 bucks a Black Hawk? Why not? Let's try it. So as you can see, it's black hot. It's a size large. I know it also comes in, uh, it's either OD or Ranger Green, and that has a medium option. The medium uh, multicam is harder to find. So we went ahead and went with a large, even though she's a smaller frame person, it was still fits the plates in there uh, with a little bit of extra space on top, but that's okay. And uh, we modified it so that it can accept a micro chest frame, the Spiritus micro fight chest frame. So I'll show you with it on there as well. So for the modification, the first thing we did was we put extra Velcro loop here so that we could put her name tape on there. Maleficent is her call sign. Then I bought some four inch multicam loop now it had some loop here, two inch for these straps that come across. But with the, the two inch, it didn't hold the chest rig on there tight and it kind of was floppy on the top. With the mags, you don't really want to do that. So I went ahead and stitched on this loop here. <clears throat> then I got surface mount side release buckles. And I'll make sure to go ahead and put in uh, the description where you can get these. Now they were Coyote and I just put multicam tape on top of them so that they blend in better with the plate carrier because I'm weird like that and like to be uniform as much as I can. So make sure you get your measurements right because if you don't, your plate carrier is not gonna fit properly. The Spiritus isn't gonna fit properly on there. So. I got this Spiritus used on eBay. I got it for stupid cheap because some guy decided he was going to cut the tabs and he didn't want the buckles. I, I don't know. Whatever. So when I guess he found out that it wouldn't work for him, he wanted to sell it. So I went ahead and just stitched them together. As you can see here, a simple straight stitch holds them. I did it three, three times over. That way it had a nice secure hold that I measured exactly where onto the vest these buckles would sit and it would fall into place. So let me go ahead and put it on there so you can see. So as you can see, it falls perfectly into place and sits very nicely. Now with mags in it, it looks pretty awesome. Really happy with the way it came out and for the price, I mean, I maybe spent $40 total on supplies to get her set up for a plate carrier and to hold armor. I was really happy with that. So on the Spiritus, I didn't like the elastic mag pouches. I, they just, I just don't care for them that much. They're okay for the pistol. I, I feel more comfortable with that, even though I modified these and tightened them up so they would fit 1911 mags that my wife uses. She uses an STI Electra. Um, I got the Haley strategic inserts for inside the actual chest rig. 
And what I did was I made these and they wrap around the Haley's and hold them into place. Um, there's double-sided Velcro, hook on that side, loop on the inside, and I put hook on the Haley itself <clears throat> and wrapped it around halfway. That way it holds them in place together and it holds the chest for it the way it's supposed to be. So you can see at the bottom where the chest rig lines up. It sits on there really nice. I'm really happy with the way this plate carrier came out. And hopefully I showed somebody a thing or two so they can make themselves a nice little plate carrier too. All right guys, thanks for tuning into this episode of CAF Tactical, civilian as fuck. Also, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.